But my entire passion, and I still will probably go back uh, to it, uh, in AI was evolutionary algorithms. You don't hear a lot about them right now. And genetic algorithms was essentially what I studied a lot. Uh, yeah. And I found out about us genetic algorithms from a fourth year uh, mining student uh, who was kind of trying to optimize kind of basically the rock sizes or something like that. I mean, he was told me about it and, and the whole concept of genetic algorithm just blew my mind. I mean. Tell us about uh, getting into consulting and, and Diamond and yeah. you know, how you started the information and analytics practice. I think it was, you know, data science was, it wasn't as popular as it is today. No. Right? Um, oh. And then how did you, you to become a partner in, in very short span of time. So you had a phenomenal growth there. Yeah, I mean, part of it is you 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 take some risks, you get some rewards. That's kind of like, like in careers that are always true. So so there's a little bit of that, a little bit of right place, right time. It's a bunch of things that happen. But one of my RSC senior, he told me, listen, you understand math, you kind of are, you're pretty smart and you, you understand practical application of it. Go and become management consultant. That's the first time I even heard what a management consultant is. So I, I started doing a lot of strategy work, or, 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 wireless spectrum auctions and this and that. But my, by that point, say I had done econometrics in graduate school, I had done econometrics, operational research. So my, my technical depth was a lot more than I left when I left Trucola. So, so I was kind of doing that. I was trying to apply some of those things in kind of context of business. Uh, and then I realized a lot of these projects and everything, there's a demand where the clients want it. Uh, and we cannot fulfill it because when you hire MBAs, no one wants to code SQL or neither do they, do they know SQL to be candid, right? Uh, and on the other hand, they all want to do strategy, but what's really is, I mean, it's it's the founded data foundational work that you need to do to kind of go and drive that was missing. The rigor was not there. Uh, so that kind of went to, uh, and, and we had seen it in this couple of these projects. The challenge was we could never staff these projects. Uh, we never could get people. Uh, and that led to this whole idea is why don't we just create a separate group, which is a unique group of people that just don't do that. Uh, and uh, so I, I and I raised my I raised my hand, or I said I want to do it. Or amazing people took bets on, like I think I was like 27 a year old at that point, and I started a business uh, within the company. So they gave me a funding. It was an internal funding. They gave, they gave me a funding. They said go and start a business and build it. See where how far you go. Uh, and that started creating the business. And like in three four years, we made like a 50 million dollar business. And eventually, Diamond got acquired by PwC. Uh, I made partner before in within Diamond because kind of just as I said there's a little bit of risk, and you kind of you take it and any advice for the budding data scientist? Budding data scientist, uh, data science is an interdisciplinary field, right? Uh, and uh, when I started, it was a lot less computing. It was a lot more math, right? I mean, you just had a lot of math and statistics. Right now, it's a uh, it's a lot more computing than this. But my point is, there's always a, then it, it's 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 a it's a weird combination of it, there will always be computing, there will always be math, and there will always be psychology and and there will be always be economics. That's those are the four things that always make decision. Choose any. I mean, there's like no other field in the world that actually is like in my mind at least a practicing field that is so rich in all kind of different disciplines that all come together and different things will become more or less important in different areas and use cases. So my, 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 my biggest advice is uh, become broader, right? I mean, there's a lot of, lot of, I mean, data scientists, you have to become deep. That's just a given, right? I mean, it's, it's, there's a word science, right, built into it. Uh, but being broader is what finally will add value.